Hi, this is Dave, Fellering Guide. Welcome to another navigation task. And this is another one where we got to compare a map and a photograph. So there's your photograph. There's the map. And what I want to know is where the photo was taken. And also, can you identify that feature circled? So where on the photograph is that feature? So let's have a look at the photograph to start with and see what we can see. Now we're obviously looking down reasonably steeply onto um, a water feature. And then over to our left, looks like there's a, a drop, a fairly steep drop to the left. And then a ridge running up to the left of the lake as we look at it. Steep ground going up and that goes out of sight. And then in the background, we've got high rocky ground comes along and it drops down into a rocky spur back down towards us, down to this water feature. We've got um, a stream that drains in towards the feature. We've also got um, rocky ground in the middle distance. In terms of man-made features, it looks like we've got some kind of wall or boundary here just to the right as we look it's going out of shot and we've got a fence line heading down towards the lake as we look so where might we be on the map so looking back on the map we've got a few water features so I've got one there one there a little one in there larger one here and then some smaller ones there and another here so is there anything about the shape of that um chlin, let's call it as it's welsh is there anything about the shape that can help us work out which one of these it is well if we look at it we can see it's got quite a distinctive shape how it, it's kind of pinched in towards the the end as we're looking at it a little bit of a, a waste there um, and also it looks like there's maybe some kind of man-made feature just on the far side as we look maybe um, some kind of um, wall line across it there so can we see that so if we have a look at the map there's only really one water feature that fits that description and that is this here as you can see it's got a narrow waist across there and we've got this man-made feature at the far side of it so it's actually this reservoir that we're looking at and we're looking at it from the north on this ridge somewhere somewhere on this fence line looking down here now i'm going to come back to discuss exactly where on the fence line the photo was taken in a moment but for now let's just have a look at um, the rest of the map so we can see here this is this ridge that rises to the left of the chlin as we look at it up and then off the edge of the photo here's the high ground in the background goes around the back of the coom and here's this rocky ridge that extends down back towards us rocky ground in the middle distance and we've got a couple of streams that drain back down here's this man-made boundary and then back to the chlin or the reservoir as we look so now let's identify the feature that's circled on the map so we're looking for this water feature here so we can see that it drains down through these rocky outcrops so just at the base of this spur that we've been looking at through the rocky outcrops down towards this boundary line and then actually comes in to Alchlin on that man-made feature there now notice that there's another 
water feature up there that also drains down and the map shows it's been a bit wider this blue is slightly thicker or wider so it's a bigger feature and that drains down it's also got a man-made feature next to it which is hard to see on the map on the photo when we look back at it so that might be a fence line so we need to decide which one of these streams is the one that's leading us back to the feature that we are looking for so stream running down towards the far end of the clin but then here we've got a narrower can't actually see the stream but it looks like it could be running down there in between these two rocky outcrops and there's the spur that we talked about before and there's this boundary feature we can't see a boundary coming down there so that may well be a fence line uh, and it's not visible rather than a bigger wall line so the feature that we're actually looking for is tucked away up in there so now to work out exactly where on the fence line the photo was taken well we've just identified the two clins up there now if you look we look like we can just about see the water feature in there were level with the top of this stream maybe just below that one there so if we know what elevation they are we can work out where we are on the map so if we look at our feature here we can see that it's just above the 530 contour there's the 530 contour there that one's just below it so that would put us at an elevation of between 530 and 540 meters so just around the o on the writing on the map there so that's where we would be so the photo was actually taken from that point there following the arrow looking over there so we were actually training for the Paddy Buckley round and um, we're just starting the ascent of Mole Singorian on the, when the photo was taken so those are your answers hope you enjoyed it hope you learned something from it thanks for watching and look out for more of these navigation challenges bye for now